Interwebbing with this little radio program Dude, we're doing for another hour. Uh, Flurry and I, I and I have to thank uh, everybody who's just emailing, uh, it just you know us in general, and just thanking us for the state. Mm-hmm. Dude, people, and it's funny though because you know working in this medium for all the years we both have collectively, yeah, you know, obviously it, you're here alone. And, you know, you, you you do your thing. It, it could be a bit. It could be whatever. You have no audience. I have my dog in here for the most part. I don't know if something's working or something. And she's going. a very attentive and audience, she, too. She, 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 she's sleeping right now. Yes. But the thing is, we don't see or really hear the passion all the time. You know, and I'm getting these emails and just thanks, everybody, for yeah. sending emails. People are passionate about this format. You and know, that's, just... a, that's a really good point. I mean, we uh, you, you've had a few today that you've mentioned to me. Um, let's see. I've, I've got... You know, random stuff. I get like this one from uh, from Ben, who actually works for Bonneville Broadcasting in Seattle. Okay. So he works for um, for uh, Seven Ten Cairo, and uh, he's a huge fan. He sits there at his desk at, at, at a new at the main news talk station in Seattle, and he listens to us. Wow. And there's what's ironic about that is that one of the the oldest, actually, I, I take that back, the oldest terrestrial dance station in the country is in Seattle. It's a high school station called C89.5. It's KNHC. Uh, it's a great station. It's Probably been there for like 20 years. They have a full market signal. They have a full market signal. <laughs> they, have a full market signal. Really? they show up in the ratings. Wow. Yeah, wow. they have like a three share. But but he sits there and listens to Energy Arizona for whatever reason. So yeah. thank you, Ben. Yeah. Uh, and, and we've gotten a, a ton of emails like that. Yeah. Uh, you you had the, the was it Al, Albert? Arnold. 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 Yeah, just replaced. I sent him back. 
back to that information on that John Kano track. And that's the thing. I mean, we always try to let everybody yeah. know uh, if they do have questions regarding the uh, format of particular tracks being played. I mean, you can only do so much. Yeah. Me, we already discussed. I kind of, you know, go the nth degree. And I'm kind of like that uh, somewhat of that annoying Burger King employee who really wants to be sure that the special <laughs> orders never upset us. And maybe they don't want the tomatoes or the lettuce. So they only want romaine as opposed to iceberg lettuce. I will go back in the garden and solely pick the iceberg lettuce myself. While Poe is like, you know what? I'm going to give you a piece of green paper on it. And you're going to deal with and it. And you're going to deal with it. And you're going to like it. Uh, well, we, we, we've had some great emails. I sent an email blast the other day. But this, my, of all the emails I got, this was my favorite. I'm going to read it word for word verbatim. I got yeah. this on Wednesday morning. I forwarded it to Michael, our general manager, and Ken, our, uh, one of the owners. And this reads, it's from Mitch Palmer. What's the name of this man? Mitch Palmer. You suck for letting Energy FM die. It's just that simple. Maybe all the fat you lost has been sucked into your brain. Now you are just stupid. <laughs> These are our <laughs> listeners. Thank you, Mitch. <laughs> I just got one on my MySpace. This one's going in the Hall of Fame. Okay, I just got one on my MySpace. It says, well, I guess this is a great day to die. <laughs> Happy Halloween. Wow. I'm in MySpace. Good man. Lord. It's a comment. I'll keep it up there. <laughs> Absolutely. Yes, please, please search me out on MySpace. I will it's, leave everything up there. It's going in the Hall of Fame. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't even looked at our energy all my space the, in a couple days. I have no idea fat, what's up there. All the fat that's been sucked out. Maybe all the yeah. fat you lost has been sucked into your brain and now you are stupid. Yeah, exactly. Well, Thank you, Mitch. And the thing is, hey, this is not, you know, it's not a, a malicious doing. No. You know, and that's the thing. I mean, people, you have to understand it is a business and it, yeah, businesses are in the business of trying to uh, generate money and unfortunately, there are powers that be and uh, that's that. And it, it happens. But we can't, I don't want to take away from people's passion and the love of the music and of the station because I mean geez I had a lot of great years and it's it's all good stuff here's, here, this will be a little bit of an interesting exercise what's that let's go up and down the radio down in Phoenix and let's tell you what stations have actually uh, been been gone come and gone in the time that energy's been on the air okay free FM exactly I did the zone yeah, well, it's it, 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 come and gone. Come and gone. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, come and gone. Uh, let's see. Well, it, it, no, it was always Kiss. Uh, well, Star ninety seven five. Yeah, Star ninety seven five. Yeah, Kiss was KZZP, but of course, and it was a little bit different. It wasn't yeah. quite as urban or. Um, well, let's see. There, there's a bunch of other stations. KDKB has completely changed completely themselves yes. in the time that we've yeah. been on the air. Uh, KSLX is a lot different now than they were when we signed the on. The peak, kind of. The uh, peak is yeah. no. The, the peak was K Light before it yeah, started. There you go. So, That's right. so what I'm trying to tell you is that these stations that you know and that you hear a lot. This is common in radio. This is this is you, you can't expect a station to be like KNIX, who's been in the market for forty years and has been country for forty years. That doesn't happen. That doesn't happen. So the fact that this radio station was on for six and a half years with a ten watt translator from South exactly. Mountain and a stick out in the middle of the desert in Payson that uh, nobody can hear, exactly, except for Sue from Payson who yeah. used to call us all the time. <laughs> Thank Sue, you. Thank Sue, you, Sue. Hey, I'll tell you what. And there's some people in Sedona on a vortex right now, becoming one with the universe <laughs> that are really psyched. We are booming in Sedona. That's true. We it's blast the, in the Sedona. It's not quite the mecca of entertainment, but we are booming in Sedona. I'm, I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure we have a huge listener base in like Heber. There you go. Yeah. Yes. So, so to all our Sedonaites, smoke them if you got them and enjoy the final hour. You know? Well, let's kick off the final hour as we continue to count down Energy's top songs of all time. We're somewhere in the top ten. This would be about number five or number six. It's Robbie Rivera. Love I it. absolutely love this song. Great Robbie time. Rivera is a stud. He's going to be at the Fabulous Festival in Vegas tomorrow night that we sent.